What's going on everyone and welcome to Movie Emporium's movie review of Supernova, the newest film from director Harry McCormick. Now before we begin, hey if you like this channel, awesome, hit the subscribe button to join Movie Emporium, hit that notification bell at the top to find what's coming next. If you like this video, awesome, hit that like button as well as commenting below on any video that you watch, including this one. So the movie Supernova, not the movie with Angela Bassett and Peter Fossinelli, because that movie was terrible, uh, stars two individuals named Sam and Tusker, who of course are played by Colin Firth and Stanley Tucci. Uh, they're, they've been a couple for about 20 plus years now uh one's a writer one's a musician and uh in the twilight of their life they've decided to go on a road trip and uh they're gonna go visit family and of course sam has a recital of some sort you know because he's a pianist and in the process of everything that's going on on this road trip we find out that tusker has onset dementia and he's very progressive at this point He's starting to forget things. He actually disappears at one point with his dog. And he's just, he's gotten to that point where even his ability to read what he has on the paper has kind of gone out the window. And it's a movie that basically, in a nutshell, is two individuals having to come to this reckoning, this kind of, uh, basic conclusion that at some point the Tusker Stanley Tucci character is not going to remember who Sam is, is not going to remember who he is. So it's basically about the loss of identity, about the loss of what makes us human because of the fact that he is, has onset dementia. And similar to The Father, it's a movie that is truly trying to present a very, very serious, very sad situation in a very heartfelt manner. And it's a movie about them going on a road trip and trying to, you know, deal with the situation situation and so with that said this movie has gained a lot of momentum since its initial release in september over in the uk where the movie set it's a movie that has gained a lot of traction for oscar buzz through stanley tucci and for uh, somewhat for colin first performances and it's a movie that because i like the actors so much and i like i don't necessarily like the idea but i am intrigued by the idea of people taking the idea of dementia and kind of taking it seriously taking an honest approach to about what people have to deal with it's a movie that i was really Really intrigued by watching the problem is it didn't have a distributor and it didn't have any release date for america so there was no way of watching this well you know shoot three or four months later and this movie's finally released in the states and uh, i received a screener copy for it thank you so much for that and uh i'll honestly and truly say that this movie is pretty remarkable and it's not as remarkable as like the father which truly in heartbreaking fashion truly showed you dementia but the thing about this movie that makes it so powerful is the performances of Stanley Tucci and Colin Firth. This they feel like a couple that's been together forever. The ideas and simple facts of what you know Stanley Tucci's having to deal with, the kind of denial that Colin Firth is having to deal with with the simple fact that his partner, who's known for so long, who's just losing everything about himself, is he just doesn't know how to deal with it. He's trying to take day by day, but he knows at some point in some situation that he's going to lose his partner his best friend his you know husband and it was just as you watch this movie as it progresses for like the 90 minutes as on screen you start to see it slowly and slowly eke into his brain eke into his soul about what is going to happen as this movie has it comes to its reckoning at the ending and when it comes to that ending point and you start to get the little pieces about how this movie is going to end it's very similar to another movie i saw last year which i really didn't like very much it breaks your heart it really does. It makes you want to cry because it's just so sad to see what people have to go through when they have some disease like, for instance, dementia or, you know, anything of these natures where they start to lose who they are. And Stanley Tucci just plays it perfect. It's just, it's a, it's one of his best performances I've ever seen because it's so toned down. It's so, uh, it's so dramatic. It's so heartbreaking that he just completely envelops the character. And on top of that, he's very engaging with the people around him. The, you know, they are at a diner at one point and he cracks a joke, you know, at the Sam characters, like, oh, you know, you want his autograph because you know who he is because he's a famous musician. And it's stuff like that that really helps you really, truly like, you know, Tusker as a character because Stanley Tucci is a, a well-known actor. He's a great actor, but he really gives you an emotional uh, resonance on a character that is just losing everything. And Colin Firth, who has been one of those actors that won an Oscar finally at one point for the the king's speech i think this is his best performance i really do i think the levels of emotions that he has to go through in this movie is really powerful and really sad and depressing but there's a level of just kind of acceptance that he eventually comes to a conclusion with there's a level of just love that he has for the tusker character and there's a level of just like complete just awe-inspiring for what colin firth does in the movie 
And I just, I, I love the movie. I really do. I love the performances. I think if it had been any le lesser actors, it might have become a little melodramatic. But I think what you're seeing on screen really feels authentic. I think what Harry McQueen is doing, how he's presenting, it almost feels like he he had a situation where maybe not his, maybe not a partner, but maybe somebody he knew or a family member went through something like this. And like I said, like with the father, it really feels like this is a true uh, story from the heart. And once again, it just it's because of the performances of uh, you know Colin Firth and of course uh, Stanley Tucci. So so to finish off this review, uh, it's a movie I highly recommend. It's awe inspiring. It's authentic. It has two great Oscar worthy performances from Firth and Tucci. Uh, it's a movie that really takes the material seriously. Really delves into the true nature of how hard it is for somebody to have to go through the situation. And it is a movie that doesn't doesn't insult your intelligence i guess you could say it's a movie with a lot of compassion a lot of heart and a lot of bravado when it comes to dealing with something that's so tragic and so heartbreaking it has one hell of a wallop of an ending i'll tell you that it's a it's an ending that i uh, still still think about even after watching it so it's a it's a great movie great performances so and yeah that'll do it that'll be my take on supernova thank you so much for watching uh let me know in the comments below if you decided to see the movie did you like it did you not like it all that good stuff uh but otherwise if you like what you see in this channel hit the subscribe button to join movie emporium hit that notification bell at the top to find what's coming next if you like this video awesome hit that like button and as always we'll see you guys on the next video peace out